Damn. That's a shot right there. What is Eclipso doing? Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy, you done get it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leon. I'm some cool South African geek. Welcome to my channel. About to dive right into Stargirl, the finale. They finally gonna face off against Eclipse. So we got teased of evil Stargirl last episode. Um, the whole squad back together. Or somewhat back together. I mean, Yolanda looked at her costume with so much glee in her eyes. So that could be a good sign. Or a terrible one. Anyway. I'm really excited for this finale. Really enjoyed this second season. More than the first one, actually. Even though it did have some slow moments that were predictable, I still enjoyed the hell out of it. Anyway, like if you like my reaction. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. If you are, thank you. Let's dive right in. Eclipse of Damn. This season was awesome. Don't be bad. You're gonna be evil star girl if you're bad. Oh yeah, the shade died so dumb. I will say that. Courtney Whitmore, it's summer school, 13. <laughs> Did they pass summer school already? That storyline went nowhere. He's glitching the machine. I hope this kid gets some acting jobs after this. More, that is. There are people in here? Damn, what did she do to Pat's parents? Sad. She's still having the same nightmare about evil Courtney. Goddamn. They're already gone. Catch up. Why are you looking at each other so slowly? Run. We lost contact with Beth and Dr. Me. Rick is still fixing his hour clock. Is Eclipse of bringing the Shadow Realms in here? Regret breaking it, don't you now? Yeah. So many people know their secret so identity now. Didn't they have the VFX budget for Stripes in this season? What exactly are you? Them having a vision of Beth yelling at them is killing them? Beth. Pet's run was funny. It's showtime. He's not even there. They don't have the goggles. They don't see where his true self is. Damn! Are they gonna make them fight their counterparts? Damn! Oh, she ready? But she fighting the air, technically. Pat is fighting himself? Or oh, him as Stripesy? Damn. This is all in the head, right? So all this pain, the punches, everything. Damn. She fighting her younger self? Damn. Ooh, young her can fight. Why aren't they showing us Courtney? What's happening with her? Damn. Uh, Hey yo! Eclipso basically does a lot without lifting a hand. They had destroyed this office. Damn. Ooh. He's actually fighting with his true form now? Damn. Oh. They're making him bleed, but nothing's happening. Look at them being a great team. Yeah, they're getting their ass handed to them, though. Did he fix it? Nope, he did not fix it. Oh, Thunderbolt's back! He just wants to take it in. Dude was holding back this whole time. Ooh. They actually fixed, fixed the robot. Oh, they used Thunderbolt. Dude just stabbed. And he's twerking. <laughs> Damn. 
This is cool though. Who voices Thunderbolt? If you know, please let me know. Damn! That's a shot right there. What is Eclipso doing? Oh shit. Damn, they got taken down quick, but they came in cool though. Oh, Rick. He just wore a costume, but without his power. Ooh, he bought Grandi. Smart, Rick. I kind of called it last episode that he's going to bring Grandi in this. Damn, the mural. Ooh, did he just kill Grandi? Oh, shit. Who's you? Oh ho ho! Patch! He got the Dugan! Oh shit! Is he breaking his arm? God damn! He's really trying to corrupt her. So she needed to say I hate you? Damn! Is he overpowered now? Oh shit! She embraced the darkness! Oh shit. Like dude really wanted Courtney's body. Oh power of darkness, power of light. Now I get it, cause Courtney controls the theft, controlling her gives him this power. Somebody came to the house, right? Was it Starman? Did Starman finally show up? Is that who it was? Still don't understand how this is killing them. Oh, the shade is back? So he was pretending to be dying? Do her parents know now? Look at them dressed the same. Damn. Her younger self fucked her up. <laughs> I don't think they can take on evil Courtney. They couldn't even take care of their visions. Oh, Starman! Ooh, that's cool. They have so many mentors now. You got this, Courtney. Oh, she's seeing her friends. Oh, man, the drop of friends is pissing me off. This recording is like six parts because of this. Starman gonna take his staff back. Damn. Go, Starman. Oh, Artemis brought her family back. He's outmatched now. Damn. Bye-bye, Eclipso. Sayonara. Where was Starman all this time? You really turned him to toast? <laughs> Is she back? She's actually back. Is Starman taking the shit back? So he hasn't explained why he's back miraculously. Eclipso's gone. Help. He's toast. I'm I'm not Sylvester! Yeah. She no, got a teacher. Amazing, but... He's a bad influence. <laughs> it's been so many years though. He's going to find his wife. Is she? He has another kid waiting for him? Ten years, dog. You talk to midnight now. Beth. They're trying to start their own team. Another junior junior team. Is that a flying bike? He actually finished the mural. I thought he was gonna be evil or be discovering his powers or find out Courtney's ability. Oh, they're actually telling him now. Why are they telling him it's such a public place? They besties now? Is she turning a new leaf? She's trying to join the team? That's crazy. Is he burying Grundy? How did he bring Grundy here in the first place? He's not leaving. Look at his... Her family now all over her case and shit. Now her parents are overbearing. I guess they're gonna explain it next season what happened to Sebastian. Am I saying his name right? Sylvester. <laughs> Who is it now? 
Good morning. Oh, Mr. they back. We brought Is the new season called Frenemies? <laughs> That's funny. That's actually funny. <laughs> I'm thinking about it now. You know, Sydney's gonna try to join the group, the neighbors who are kind of bad but not evil. Shade, who's bad, not evil. Solomon Grandi coming back. Then you also got Icicle Jr. on the other hand. Man, this gonna be a great season. I think I figured out what's making my ish lad. It's my GPU. How do I fix my GPU? Or how do I increase it? Or put less pressure on my GPU with my OBS? Hmm. If you guys know, tell me. This was a phenomenal season finale. Um, I was gonna react to something else, but this is this is too much. <laughs> anyway, um, it was great seeing people team up. See this relationship between Sydney and Yolanda because they've done bad things is also an interesting development. Courtney and Starman. Oh God, <laughs> Sportsmaster. What's his wife's name? Tigress and Artemis. Neighbors all happy, go lucky. We got Michael kind of now the new Stripesy. Thunderbolt. I wonder if Rick is going to find a way to fix. Why don't they ask Thunderbolt to fix Rick's machine? Necklace thing that gives him the hour clock shit. That would just make his life so much simpler. Great, phenomenal season. I'll probably give this season like an 8 out of 10. It did have slow episodes. It did have unnecessary things happen, like the shade dying, but no, he's not dead. <laughs> Him using Courtney, but not, not really using Courtney. Him hating the town, but now interested because of the kids. Also, the shade being turned into toast. That was comedic, but it did have some dope visuals. Also, the way they realized Green Lantern's daughter's powers, I don't like it. Jeff Johns should know better. He wrote one of the best uh, Green Lantern stories. To now use the Green Lantern power like that, like some bloodline-ish. Like it's just a light. Or um, oh, a beacon, a map beacon. You can do so much more. She should be recorded, uh, recruited by the core. You know what I'm saying? The Green Lantern Corps. But anyway, phenomenal episode. Phenomenal season. Deuces.